A veteran deputy with the Bear County Sheriff's Office for a decade arrested, accused of child sexual assault. Garrett Berger joins us now with more information about the arrest and how Bear County Sheriff Javier Salazar is responding. Garrett. Well, the 10-year veteran of the Bear County Sheriff's Office, Jose Nunez, a deputy and a detention officer assigned here to the jail annex. He was now the one he's being detained, arrested for the super, the super aggravated sexual assault of a four-year-old girl. And the Sheriff's Office says he tried to cover up that abuse with threats. The details of the case are, quite frankly, heartbreaking, disturbing, disgusting, and um, infuriating all at the same time, to be honest with you. It was a long night for Bear County investigators. The mother of a four-year-old arrived at a local fire station Saturday with a nauseating accusation against one of the girl's family members, Bear County Deputy Jose Nunez. As we understand it, this uh, suspect uh, had physical contact with this little girl, which caused pain and at least some indication of, of minor injury. Within hours, Nunez was arrested. Investigators were working to figure out how big this case might be. We know that it's been going on for several months. Uh, we are not ruling out the fact that it could have been going back several years. Right now, all we have is direct evidence for us that this, this little girl was the only victim. However, I would not rule out the existence of other victims. According to the arrest affidavit, the girl's mother, who was undocumented, told investigators this had happened another time about a month ago. But when she confronted Nunez, he threatened to have her deported. Salazar urged undocumented immigrants to come forward if they have been the victim or witness to a crime and report it. Just like we're doing in this case, we are uh, filling out paperwork with, uh, with this uh, witness in question to make sure that she's, she's given uh, protected status pending the outcome of this case. While Salazar said instances like this with his deputies disappoint him, he and his office know exactly how to handle them. We will absolutely arrest you if you break the law. And it doesn't matter if you wear a uniform, if you carry a badge, if you carry a gun. If you break the law, you're going to jail. We've learned now that Nunez has been booked into the jail, though he won't be staying here for long. Sheriff Salazar said the new policy is that any incarcerated deputies are transferred as soon as possible to another facility. He did not know exactly which facility that would be. Live at the jail, I'm Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News.